As a content creator, I've come into this issue and it's given me a lot of problems in the past and lately I've been kind of rolling into it but I found a way to move around it. So hey, what's up? What's going on? Hope you're doing all right. My name is Matt and this is Wire Creatives and we're talking about this whole concept of really hitting that roadblock and finding a way around it. Now for me, in the past, I've always had the little points where I've been on it. Lately, I've been kind of stuck in it a little bit more here and there. Now, if you're an artist, if you're a musician, if you do content creation, if you're marketing, all of us have felt this at one point. And it's being able to move past that how that really defines those who can really step it up. For me, like many other people, I like to have a small pool of different ideas. I'll just go ahead and drop them in. And if I'm looking for something when I really can't find anything, I'll go in there, dig around, maybe find something that I can use to kind of throw like a little story in here, right? So last weekend we went to Caffeine and Octane. I really like these events and they have a lot of different vehicles out there. They try to do themes. So we got there and decent amount of people. It was pretty hot and the humidity was up, but it wasn't unbearable. Walking around and trying to get this idea that I had planned out in my head just wasn't working out. So about like a quarter into it, I just said, hey, you know, I'm not gonna work with this right now. It's just gonna end up frustrating me more. That's something for me when I worked on detailing a plan out and I have every little point and not being able to hit those is being able to say, hey, that's okay. We're just gonna kind of pivot and move around that. So for that event, you know, I just put my stuff away, enjoyed my time there with my wife and we walked around. And that's just something that you'll have issues with. And I've had this issues in the past. I have different ideas like, hey, for this event, this is the way I want to shoot it. This is what I want to do. You get there and it just doesn't work out. And maybe you just move around. Hey, actually, this would work a lot better. So you go out and use that for your content. For me, I like to always be ready. And that's part of my like EDC stuff. Everyday carry, make sure you have what you need. And there's different levels, different uh, categories for this. And for my like video content stuff, I usually always carry a camera on me. So that's going to be my Fujifilm X106. And then this camera right here, which is the DJI Osmos Pocket 3. Super compact, just drop them into my sling. I always have them on me. A few weeks ago, we're out doing errands. We've got coffee. We drive through this area. It's more like of an industrial area. And I guess on the weekends, it's empty there. They actually had a few buildings that were empty, empty, empty. So like there were no one in there. They're trying to lease it out. And this parking lot we came across, it had some bushes. So it was kind of secluded, which helped cut down on the noise. And that's where I ended up shooting my basic car angle shot video. I'll leave a link right there. And that's just one of those things if you're out, the opportunity may just come up and just take it go with it roll with it that's another thing that i've really been trying to work on is just really going with the flow because having everything planned out if it doesn't work out you know that really sucks but you just kind of go roll with it and then new opportunities will pop up and being spontaneous saying hey we're going to pull over here i want to take a photo series of this or hey this would look perfect adding to the story being able to stop slow down take in what's around there and really be able to focus on what you want to do at that moment so there you go that's my kind of advice or thoughts or whatever you want to call it on this whole youtube journey and trying to get past those robots when you come on it now as i mentioned i said i've only been doing this for about like seven months and i know there's a lot more people that have a lot more experience but for me as a small time creator this is what I've been doing to stay consistent. You know, I've been doing two videos every week since the beginning of the year, and it's been rough. As I said, you know, I do come across those roadblocks. For me, I've just been trying to just move around it, just keep going, and maybe something else will come up. Saying that, you might have noticed, you know, like two minute Tuesdays, I'm pretty consistent. Will always come out on Tuesday, usually earlier in the day. And then for my longer format video or my other video. It will come out usually on a Friday. Lately, it's been Saturday because of these roadblocks or my time constraints and just for me, just rolling with it and hey, I can't get it out today. I'm not gonna stress about it. I'm gonna get it out the next day and that's perfectly okay. Especially if you're just starting out, especially if you're still figuring out what you really wanna do. Don't stress too much about it. It's not worth all the added stress, especially with everything we have going on in life. So yeah, there you go. As always, down in the comments, always enjoy getting back to all y'all. If you have any questions or comments, leave those down there. If you have anything that you'd like me to expand on, let me know down there too. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.